Oh, you got two, I believe. We only got the first one. I'm not pissed at the moment. I can't remember. To be honest, I'm not that pissed. We really, haven't had about four blood. I, I am football. Because the end of the day, the only winner was football. So the match finished about half an hour ago. A group of us are heading up to the woods. So we have got a bomb here, a bomb night, a bomb for our night. November the 5th, but we couldn't manage it. So we've got a load of fireworks, a load of food, a load of beer, obviously. We're going to head up to the woods. And I've just got to the park and make the jovial and juggy joke and have his house with the rest of the troops. They won't say they'll be here in a bit. And the moon's out as well. I've got four red bows now and about. We've got back to the green again. We've been in since we got back. It's behind me. Make his fuck off cloud you've ever seen. Bleeding, bloody hell, he's not for him. I've seen a bully. Bleeding, you know? It's always a complication. Rico, Rico, Rico. Ah, I brought a song. I am. You might have been there. Right, I thought you might be cleaning up, huh? Oh yeah, we could dust and hunch, bust the game, right? Oh, not even a bit of wood here, are we, eh? Get all your sweets together. Not garbage bags. I'm just breaking up. Give me a fight! Well, I'll say fire, I'm just having a fight, aren't they? Ah, Jody! Ah, Jody! Tony, what am I going to do? Hello there listeners, and welcome to a new part of the show, in which, myself, Bleeding Obvious Bob, will be offering, Bleeding Obvious Advice to you, the listener, in, Bleeding Obvious Bob's, Bleeding Obvious Advice Show, my first piece of Bleeding Obvious Advice, is directed at you, the listener, but particularly, in the direction of Steve, the advice I shall advise you on is, do not cover yourself in petrol, when you are going to be spending the, rest of the evening, sat around the fire or letting up fireworks, yes listeners, it is very obvious advice, but it seems he is unaware of this. Perhaps the advantages of using this piece of advice should be demonstrated to Steve by throwing a lit match at him, but this is only a suggestion. That's all for now. But remember kids, play safe. The bidding obvious advice show could be but isn't. Sponsored by AT&T's Natural Voices. That was most entertaining, but enough of that shit, let us move on to the highlight of the show, ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce to you the ever so handsome, Mr. Mel Gibson. Hello, it's great to be here, thanks, for having me on the show, how are you all doing? We're doing fine, now you're here Mr. Gibson. Oh please, call me, Mel. Well, Mel, that's a lovely name, almost as lovely as you. Oh, thanks, you're too kind. Yes, a most lovely name, is Mel short for something, Melonhead, perhaps. 
Erm, no, just Mel. I notice your voice sounds a little rough today. Yes, well, I have a bit of a cold, and the journey here didn't help. Oh really, I meant to ask, how was your journey here? Well, you know, it's like a jungle out there. <laughs>